Well, this is definitely news to me, and I have a feeling it's gonna be for most of you as well. Guys, did you know that Dickie's Barbecue Pit actually has a brisket burger on the menu? Yeah, I couldn't believe it either. Like I said, it's news to me, and of course I've got it up next for you here on the channel, so stay tuned, because I'm Ian Kay, and you're about to peep this out. Welcome to Peep This Out Reviews with Ian Kay. Stay frosty. Yeah, this thing is definitely packing a punch, and I gotta say, it's got some heft to it, guys. It almost feels like a Five Guys burger. This is looking pretty awesome. Feast your eyes on the brisket burger here at Dickie's Barbecue Pit. A very nice combination of goodness on this one. Let me break it on down for you real fast. Yeah, this is definitely looking like it's got that backyard barbecue feel, guys. It absolutely has some height, and the presentation is looking pretty awesome on it. So let's pop this toasted brioche-style bun and take a look underneath. And what you're gonna notice right away is a special sauce that they've got over here that's comprised with a little bit of mayo, pickle juice, and barbecue sauce, because guys, this is Dickies after all, but I'm very curious about that combination. It definitely sounds pretty good. As we pan on down, it looks like we've got a decent amount of crunchy dill pickles there looking very nice, a slice of tomato, and what looks to be a slice of cheddar cheese on top of their brisket burger patty. A fairly decent amount of beef on this one, guys. It's looking pretty nice. Underneath it, it looks like we have some leaf lettuce and nothing on the very bottom of this one. But guys, with everything being front loaded on the top, I gotta say a lot of classic ingredients and overall the size is looking pretty awesome on this. So let's not waste any more time on this one. Let's see if the flavor is gonna deliver. This is the brisket burger here at Dickie's Barbecue Pit. Let's peep out this flavor. So yeah, if you're looking for a special sauce over here at Dickie's, that is absolutely it. A combination of mayo, barbecue sauce, and pickle juice. That is something definitely different, guys. But a burger on the menu over here, I never would have thought. And again, just to keep showing it to you, this looks pretty banging. I mean, look at this. All those ingredients, it really does feel like a backyard barbecue situation. And I gotta say, considering I did check out their mac and cheese sausage recently, another combination of goodness there. The classic burger over here, but with brisket? Very interesting. So without further ado, let's get into it. Here we go. It's the brisket burger. Apparently on the menu over here as a normal item for Dickie's Barbecue Pit. Let's peep this out. Mmm. Mmm. Yeah, that is not your standard burger patty, guys. Very rich, almost with an Angus vibe, believe it or not. But the combination of that sauce, the barbecue, the mayo, and that pickle juice, the tartness that I'm getting, the tang from that as well, along with the crunch of the pickle right there, a very lovely situation. That was a very hearty first bite already. Very flavorful. Let's keep going in, guys. Pretty banging already. Mmm. Wow, don't sleep on this one, guys. I'm getting shades of the Arby's burger with this one. This is a really pretty banging situation overall. And as you can see, that meat is pretty decent right there, along with all the fresh produce on the top of this one. Those pickles are amazing. The cheddar cheese, everything is very flavorful. But one of the main highlights, if not the burger itself, is going to be that sauce. Because like I said, the tartness and tang from the pickle juice is really shining through with this. Very nice with the mayo and that barbecue sauce. Very nice. But a little on the messy side. Thankfully, I've got some napkins to kind of give myself a pseudo burger diaper with this one because you really need it. That sauce is beginning to run. But man, guys, a beautiful presentation. And honestly, if you put this up next to the Arby's burger, it looks very, very similar, actually. It almost feels like I've got a little bit of pink action right there on the beef, but a lovely situation. The patty itself looking very nice. It looks like it was grilled off on the back. Almost like a frying type of situation, as you can tell by the footage on screen here right now. But guys, a very nice situation on this one. I'm only sorry I didn't get the double, actually, because for $2 more, you can add another patty. I might have to do that the next time I give this one a shot. Pretty nice. So let's go for another couple of bites on it. Mmm. Yeah, this is well worth the $5.95, guys. It smokes a lot of the regular fast food burgers that are out right now, and just in general, even the most classic ones as well. A combination of that brisket beef, it's very rich tasting, almost like a Wagyu situation, but a very lovely thing across the board with all the toppings on this one. And I'm totally digging that sauce, like I said. I know it's a broken record with me right now. It is so delicious with the tartness and the tang that I'm getting from it, the snap and crunchiness of those pickles, everything along with it, a beautiful situation on this. And I can actually taste that cheese, which is another banging situation as well. So let's go for one more quick bite on this one. We'll wrap the review with the rating coming up next, but very surprising with this one on the menu. And I gotta say, I'm glad I'm checking this out right now for the very first time on camera with you guys. So one more bite and we'll wrap this one up. Hang on. Yeah, definitely a delicious situation on this one, guys. And if you happen to be watching this review after hours right now, please accept my humble apologies because if you got Dickies in the area, you need to be getting up the next morning immediately and giving this one a shot. It is well worth your time. A lot of fresh produce on this one, but that beef patty along with that sauce is awesome. Definitely check this one out. It's highly worth your time. 
Well, very surprising with this one, guys. Considering Dickies is known primarily for Texas barbecue, they actually do a brisket burger pretty awesome over here. And I have to say, with the score that you're seeing here on the screen right now, I think it reflects that. This is a super delicious burger across the board with all the flavors. And like I said, for $5.95, that is a pretty decent value on top of everything else that you're getting with that. Again, that sauce is amazing and it goes so beautifully with the brisket burger itself. Just an overall, a nice combination of goodness and easily, like I said, worth your time. Give this one a go. All right, so do me a quick favor like always. Drop those comments down below. Let me know what you thought of the look of this brisket burger over here at Dickie's Barbecue Pit. Did it really satisfy the presentation for you right now based upon my review? And if you've already given this one a shot, how closely does it resemble a backyard barbecue burger eating experience? Drop those comments down below and definitely let me know. And with that, this is Ian K closing out another high quality foodie feature for you here on Peep This Out Reviews, bringing you brand new content every single week here on my channel. So why stay tuned for the next review coming real soon. In the meantime, stay frosty. Hey, thanks for checking out this review. But just in case you didn't see the one I did before this one, you can find it right up over here, along with what I think YouTube's gonna recommend for you to check out as well. As always, I think you'll find something to like in both of them, and I'll definitely catch you in the next one. See ya.